Keep it simple, sweetheart. That's the KISS principle. I don't believe in calling people stupid. That's just the way I roll. Yourself or anyone else. So when we look at these, uh, this is the oil, old oil filter. There's the tongue twister for you. And this is the new one. Um, as you go to do an inspection on them, you'd think that they're different, especially if you use any of these sockets. This one fits onto this oil filter. It does not fit onto this other one. I'll just let the oil drip on the ground. This is important to see this. So, as you can see here, that does not fit. It's just too small. So you're like, okay, well, we'll try another one. This type fits big ones and small ones. See how it's got a double step to it? Surely that's going to fit. It doesn't. Okay, well, let's try another one. Let's try one for a Volvo that's odd duck. Nope. How about the bigger size? Nope. Nothing fits it, even though this one fits this. So apparently this is the wrong oil filter because it doesn't fit, right? Wrong. Well, back to the KISS principle. Um, we're going to apply it literally here because whenever I do an oil change, you want to make sure that the O-ring didn't stick to the engine and get a double O-ring and a failure seal. You want to take oil and lube up the new o-ring right so it doesn't bind and create a leak well we also need to verify that this filter is going to work and that it's the same filter seal diameter as this one well how are we going to do all that it's going to take a little while isn't it nope you just take the two filters and i just verified the size i just verified the o-ring is uh, not stuck to the engine. I just lubed this up. I did all that just by making them kiss And then you can also look at it and see if their thread pitch looks about the same and if the hole looks about the same And then you can put the new one in. I don't know where this came from. This says it's a prime This is on a 01 Civic CRV EX uh, With the 2 liter. It says prime pro guard POF 4459 and this other one's an S2808, which is really common. So this was probably one that an oil filter shop or oil change shop put in. This is one that I'm going to put in. So there's the KISS principle applied to oil changes. Neat little trick. Now I know people like to stir up trouble and they're going to bomb the comments with stuff like... Now most of the people aren't like that, but you get a few. You just remember them. Because your memory works based on emotion. If you about got killed, you've got survival mechanism built in, right? So if you have a traumatic situation, you remember that so you don't have that again. And that's an awesome... Dude, we're, we're built awesome. <laughs> I just tell you that we're built just about close to perfect. So anyway, that's why we remember these things. So um, I'm going to just do a little disclaimer on the end of this video. And people will say... The old filter's full of crap. That's what it's there for. <laughs> you know, that filter's got all these contaminants in it, and you just contaminated the new filter. Good job! No, that ain't right. The way that you do it, you have, and this is probably an important thing to put on anyway, you don't take the old filter and dump it into the new one. No, when they kiss, you have the other one just a little bit higher so there's no backflow from the old filter into the new filter because that'd just be silly. Why would you do that? Why would you contaminate the new filter? I don't know. Somebody's going to be like, you've got your eyes closed. You're on, you know, something's wrong with you. <laughs> You're going to mess it up, but no. You know, I kind of expect people to realize that you don't want the old filter stuff to go into the new one. So anyway, why would I make a disclaimer that's longer than the video itself? I don't know. But uh, I trust you guys. I got a lot of smart viewers. And the reason why I say that and the reason why I can claim that is because people that want to educate themselves, if they want to be prepared ahead of time, if they want to gather information from the Internet, they're smart. <laughs> So, you know, I give them the benefit, benefit of the doubt. I almost said benefital. That sounds like a pretty good time to me, you know. Anyway, long story short, KISS principle is pretty awesome. Keep it simple. And so that's what we do here.